My name is Carl Kesselman. I'm a professor in the Viterbi School of Engineering and a fellow in the Information Sciences Institute. For the past 10 years or so, um, my research has been focusing on how large-scale distributed infrastructure can be used to solve some of those challenging problems in science and engineering. This resulted in us creating what's become widely known as grid computing, which has been used um, to do things such as support data analysis at the Large Hadrian Collider. It's been used to support uh, the global change um, studies, which resulted in Al Gore winning a Nobel Peace Prize. And recently, over the last several years, we've been applying this technology to the challenging problems of healthcare. We're really looking at a problem that's often called evidence-based medicine, which is how do we look in more detail at the results and looking at what things work and what things don't work. In essence, rather than limiting a clinical trial to just 1,000 individuals or 7,000 individuals that it normally includes, to make every visit to a doctor's office part of expanding our base of knowledge. We're confident that the grid-based approach that we're taking to solve this problem will yield significant advances in the near future. This confidence is based partly on the successes that we've seen in solving some of the most challenging problems in science and engineering, and also the significant advances we've seen in application of this technology to clinical and research problems in medicine over the last several years. One of the big challenges in supporting evidence-based medicine is managing the huge amount of information that's becoming available through new testing and measurement techniques. It's almost impossible for any individual, no matter how dedicated or smart, to keep track of these rapid advances and figure out how to apply some of these new advanced measurements and approaches to their individual patients. One of the advantages of the approach that we're advocating is the ability to help manage and control that information to allow the physician to make the best decisions based on the best available information for that individual patient. Many people have had the example of having to physically carry their medical records or x-rays from one office to another office as they work their way through the medical system, resulting in extra anxiety, lost records, and extra burden on the patient. Using our infrastructure, grid computing infrastructure, we're able to remove that from the patient, electronically transferring records from one hospital to another, from a doctor to a radiologist, improving need of care, the quality of care, the security of care, and ultimately having a personal impact on the patient's experience.